Hi, it's CIS 105 students. I just wanted to make this short video to explain the difference between Office 365 and the desktop versions of the applications because it's very important that you use the desktop version of uh, 365 when you're doing your assignments or you won't have all the menu options. So for instance, if I go to um, Office 365 or just type in office.com, that's going to bring me to this Office 365 interface. So if I launch Word from here, uh, it's going to look, and, and, I, and I'll launch a blank document. The menu options that you have available to you are much more limited. It'll look like this. So if you're doing your assignments in Word and it looks like this, you're in the wrong application. And to get to the right one, you need to go down to the Windows icon here, or your Start menu and launch Word from there. And you'll notice the difference when I launch Word from there and I open up a blank document, it's gonna look quite different. So notice the difference in the menus. Let me make this a little wider. And this problem keeps coming up where I get students that say, my menu options aren't, the menu options that you're showing in your videos aren't in mine. And that's because you're probably in the Office 365 version and not the desktop version, which is this one here. Okay, see how the menus are quite different? Um, I'm on the home menu here. Look how many more options there are in this. This is the desktop version, the bottom one. The bottom window is the desktop version. So you want to make sure you're using the desktop version. And to make sure that you're using the desktop version, you use you launch it from the start menu. Don't launch it from your browser. If you launch it from your browser, you're going to be using the wrong one. So um, I can't stress that enough because it causes tremendous frustration to you as the students when you're trying to use this top menu here versus the uh, regular Word desktop version. Okay, so I hope that clarifies this once and for all. Um, and we don't have any pr more problems because um, I hate for you to have that kind of frustration in class or when you're doing your assignments at home. So make sure you're using the desktop versions. Now, the same thing applies to um, Excel so and, and all the other Microsoft Office applications. Okay. So um, if we go back here and you launch Excel from here, and do a blank workbook, this version of Excel is going to look way different than if I launch it from my uh, desktop. So I'm going to go to the Start menu, and I'm going to launch the desktop version of Excel. And I'm going to do a blank workbook. And let's compare those menus to each other. OK, look how many more options you have in the desktop version of Excel. They're both on the Home tab, but look how many more options. Some of them are the same, and you'll be able to do some of the things this, just like you do on the, on the desktop version, but there's way more options in the desktop version. So always use the desktop version when you're doing your assignments. All right, if you have any questions, don't feel free to contact me, and I'll help you understand it if, you're, if it's still not clear to you. So thanks a lot, guys. And I hope this helps.